I have been in and out of the house in my room for quite some time now and because I am trying to declutter different sections, I kind of have some piles that I need to donate and haven't done that yet because the pickup that we usually have isn't coming anymore so I need to try to figure out what can be done so that I can go ahead and just donate those boxes because when I have a little bit of mess in my room, <laughs> it makes it so much easier to just keep the mess going for some reason. I don't know why my brain works like that, but that's just what it does. And I just got done doing laundry because the next thing that I want to tackle is right behind this door, my closet. It is also a little bit hard for me to walk through my closet because I've just started putting everything in there when people come over. And so I am going to hang up all my clothes so that everything's in there and get that all done. And then I can go through it all because I know that I'm way happier with less. I just got done with my bookshelf and just being able to look at it, it makes me smile because it's so clean and I love it so much. I still want to paint it and do some other things, but I am happy with where it's at right now. And then also there are a few things in my room because I have kind of made a mess in my room already. I need to just do a few things like get rid of some old flowers as much as I love them. They uh, have served their time. So got to do that as well. The shirt is so old and the logo is falling off, but I still wear it. The worst thing about laundry is putting all these pads back into the sports bras. I might be getting rid of these. I told my mom that they don't fit, so she wants me to go ahead and give them to her if I don't want them anymore. So now I got pretty much everything picked up in my room except for the top of my dresser which has some stuff on it but most of it's probably going to go into my little memory box which is in my closet that's going to come out once I start bringing everything out which is just going to make a mess in here again but hopefully this will be fast and I'll get it all done in one day and that way my room won't be messy anymore. I still need to get those flowers out of here the petals are falling and I don't want any of the, the stuff that falls off of them to stain anything. I was able to salvage some of the flowers which I love. All right, now it's time to go behind these doors and see my closet before it is decluttered. Gotta put my nifty door stopper here, which is a hockey puck because my door just keeps closing on me. WD-40 works too well. Okay. Okay, this is a walk-in closet. So here's the front when I first walk in. All the top stuff is pretty much gonna stay because it's hiking. And camping and then here's the rest it's just kind of tight right walking right here and so see when it's not on the 0.5 lens it's easier to see so I don't really have a strategy quite yet of what 
I'm going to do, but I think first I'm gonna clear up the floor so that it's easy to walk through. And in the process of me taking out things, I'm just gonna go ahead and trash things that I don't need and put pile put things into a donate pile for what I wanna donate. And then the keep will probably go on my bed, except for my shoes. I don't want that on my bed. Definitely not the best place for a paddleboard, but it's the only place I have. I'm gonna go through stuff as I bring it out because I really do not want to have to come back and go through things. So I'm just making sure everything's out of here. I don't see a reason in keeping this box because I feel like Apple should have my purchase saved on their account. So this is trash and this can become a bag with donations in it, possibly. No. <laughs> ah. I'm so sad because I really don't want to get rid of these because these are the only cowboy boots I have, but I never wear them because they are so tight and hurt my feet so bad. People said that they would stretch, but I just went way too small where I can't even get my feet in them comfortably. So they're never going to stretch. And these are trashed. They're so old, even though I almost reached for them yesterday, but I ended up not actually wearing them. I do not know if I'm going to regret bringing everything out just to bring it all back in, but I know I need to clean the floors and clean the baseboards, I think. Yeah, definitely got a little bit of dust on them. These are all keep. Keep. These were my old running shoes and I just got new ones. So I'm going to use these as yard work shoes. So I'm going to go put them upstairs right now. I went ahead and got two bags of trash and a donate bag so that I do not have to look at what I'm throwing away and what I'm donating anymore because then I might think about it too much because I'm already eyeing my cowboy boots because I love them, but at the same time I don't. So I just need them out of my sight. Picture frame has a ton of broken back, so it won't even hold pictures anymore. Can't decide if these shoes are donatable or not. They look bad. And yes, I realize I have not put <laughs> my cowboy boots in the donate bag yet, but I don't want them to get squished at the bottom. I should just put them in the hallway. Oh well. These shoes, very uncomfy. And these I never wear. Donate. I always keep these shoes because I feel like I need a pair of black sandals. But literally they have so much dust on them because I haven't even worn them once this summer and the summer is already almost over. This is when decluttering takes forever, when I have to try stuff on because I just don't know. I do not know why I don't wear these.
I'm gonna give them a week. And if I don't wear them within the week, they're going. Let's be honest, I'm probably not gonna wear them during the week. <laughs> But I did it with my jewelry and it worked out really well. I gave myself two weeks because I had so much jewelry. And so that ended up working really well. I wore some of it, but I knew I wasn't going to wear most of it. And shocker, I did not wear most of it. So it worked out that I just got rid of it. All this stuff literally came from in my bedroom. But the reason I put it in my closet is because I was trying to do the men's game where you get rid of however many days you're on. So basically the first day you get rid of one thing, second day two things. But I was going in any order and the problem was is that I was always like, oh I need to film this and so I would put it in my closet and then I was just making a bigger mess. So I'm not doing the men's game anymore and just trying to get rid of everything that I need to get rid of. So this whole top of the dresser, or whatever this is called, is supposedly holding all my yard work clothes because I do so much yard work apparently. I don't anymore, but got some stuff to donate. But I think I'm going to do the wall first so that it's better. Let's be honest. I find this so fun, <laughs> but I don't think I've worn it in years, but it's about to be Labor Day, so maybe I'll give myself Labor Day, see if I wear it. If not, then it's going in the trash because it's kind of dirty. Oh. This is why it's a bad idea <laughs> to try on everything because you find stuff and you're like, oh, this is cute. Why haven't I worn it? But it's kind of tight on my head. I just got this and apparently it is a 60 year old sweater I think or a little over 60 year olds 60 years old this is my grandpa's I got out of my mom's closet because she doesn't really wear it but I cannot wait to wear this I feel like my walk-in closet is becoming my runway because I wear everything going out and then exit I'm running out of hangers so that also means that I need to get rid of some clothes. I am majorly failing at dwindling down my yard work clothes. These I don't like to wear. I'm making progress, <laughs> even though out here it looks like I'm making them. Let's donate three pairs of pants. I'm hoping that I can narrow down all my winter stuff here, my sweaters, so that then I can have a little cubby for my yard work stuff. So it's not just out here. I definitely got sidetracked. I said I was gonna do this whole side and did not. Oh well. I literally wear all of this. That was a bit of a fail, me trying to make space for my yard work clothes. But I can make just two piles. Okay, 
It's my old purse. I think I can get rid of this. Huh. It's filled with stuff. I'm struggling. This is when it's nice to have someone else to help you go through your clothes and stuff because once you talk through things, sometimes it just is ridiculous and it's easier to let things go. But I know I use this one for fancier events and this one, it's just my old purse and this is the one I use now. I just found fabric from a DIY that I did and I was going to end up sewing them to make them be little napkins because I like the color of them. But now they're so frayed. Not sure what I'm going to do with them yet. I'm going to clean as I go so I need to go get a vacuum and some cleaning products. I swear they gave out a medal for every single cross country race <laughs> ever. Some of them don't even have anything on the back. Oh, 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 oh,